Hello, Weathermatic world. Let's take a look at the integration between Weathermatic SmartLink and Aspire. We'll find out how to take an irrigation inspection or site audit in SmartLink and create an estimate and opportunity inside of Aspire. The first step is to make sure that SmartLink and Aspire have the same naming for irrigation line items or kits. Let's get started. What you see here is the import tool into SmartLink. We will need two pieces of information from Aspire. First, we need the item name, which can also be your kit name. To find that information, go into Aspire Administration, scroll to Estimating, then click Manage Items. Your item name will be found here. The second piece of information we need from Aspire is the service name. This can be found under the Administration tab as well. Simply click Estimating, then Manage Services. There you will find the service name. Once these steps are completed, it should look like this prior to import into SmartLink. Here's a brief example. We were able to get the item name or kit name from Aspire. We were also able to get the service name, which in this particular case is Extras and Irrigation Repair. Utilizing these templates, we're able to make sure SmartLink has the same exact naming as Aspire. Once naming is consistent across both SmartLink and Aspire, we can now perform an inspection and create an estimate in Aspire. There are currently a multitude of ways of doing this. In one example, the irrigation inspection is performed in the field and written on paper, perhaps a clipboard or legal pad. Then, at the end of the day, the irrigation tech turns the paperwork into an account manager or administrator back at the office. The inspection gets transcribed into a set format. In this case, it would be an Aspire estimate. The estimate will now be sent as a proposal to the customer. Our goal is to streamline this process, making it fluid, reducing duplication of efforts, and tightening up the time that it takes to complete. As we know, inspections equal revenue, and if we can be quicker and more accurate with our estimates, we will increase our ability to drive revenue inside of our business and provide a better service to the customer. Now, we'll create an estimate and perform an inspection from SmartLink. First, pick the controller to start the inspection. Next. Name the inspection. There are many different naming conventions. However, the most utilized is month plus controller name. Once you have named the inspection, select Generate Proposal to begin. The inspection tool will now pop up inside of SmartLink. From here, we're able to turn on and off our controller and our zones to perform the inspection. So, by using their phone or their tablet, an irrigation tech out in the field will be able to notate issues. For example, if someone has a couple of clogged nozzles, it will say, Spray Nozzle. As you see here, SmartLink continuously learns the most commonly used items for this particular category of repair, then populates these items within this section. We could also add a photo. For example, maybe in Zone 2, the valve doesn't come on, and we've commonly used either a 1-inch valve or a 2-inch valve. Maybe in this particular case, it's a little bit different. We do a quick search and find out it's an inch and a half valve. So we add that to our inspection report. Here's another example. Maybe we turn on zone 3 and notice we have a couple of broken heads. We see the most commonly used heads and know we're going to use one of those. These are going to be rotors. There's two of those. Zone 3 is done. Maybe we have a leak in zone 4 too. We notate lateral line leaks on zone 4. We're going to add those two leaks and we're going to go ahead and complete this inspection. The tech in the field will simply hit save. And once this inspection is saved in SmartLink, the account manager, admin, or department manager, whoever is going to put together the estimate in Aspire, is instantly notified via email that an inspection on this controller has been completed. From that email, you can either click on the link and it will take you back to this inspection, or you can log into SmartLink and go to this controller and be able to reach this inspection. At this point, we're going to pause for a second to ensure the Aspire tab is open in addition to SmartLink. Now, in Aspire, we're in the Opportunities tab. We've gone to Property, we've created an Opportunity, and now we're going to create an Estimate. As you see, the Estimate for this Opportunity? There's nothing in it yet. We're going to grab that from the Inspection tool in SmartLink. So up in the top right on the Estimate page, find the ellipses, these three dots. In the dropdown, select Imports. We're going to use Aspire's import function, which will be a pop-up that looks like this. And then we go over to the SmartLink tab. We follow the link to this inspection. We're going to use the Export button here, 
and scroll down to Aspire Export, and that will export into an Excel format, and we'll see that in our downloads. So now we're going back to the Aspire import. We're going to drag that download into Aspire. We're going to click Import here. Once you see it's been successfully imported, we click out of that. And from there, Aspire has immediately taken all of those repairs that were notated in the inspection and created the estimate. All your pricing carries through. And now, this estimate is complete. You're now able to send this proposal to your customer. And that is how we make a streamlined process from a SmartLink inspection into an opportunity in Aspire. Thank you for your time.